Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and we're going to create something called a subdomain. A uh, subdomain is an easy way for us to take a site and break it into different logical sites if we choose to, or to actually just leverage a domain name for several sites. In this case, our example and your um, homework will be to create a subsite, a uh, subdomain, and a site on it um, and using uh, Professor Savage, Professor Dash Savage, at uh, I mean dot your subdomain dot com or whatever your your address is. So we're going to go ahead and go to my domains, and we're going to go to hosted domains. Instead of hosted domains, I want to point out once again the video tutorials on this hosting is excellent. Um, it breaks it down into very small pieces so that you are able to understand some different things. I would encourage you to use these as you go through and use the hosting panel. Um, you will learn a great deal about hosting panels and your server and, and things that you can do. With that said, you can see my domain. Yours is um, obviously a different domain, and you can actually see that we have subdomain underneath this. I'm going to go ahead, and we're going to create a subdomain under Rack Real Life, and we're going to call it Professor Dash Savage. We want to make sure that we're grabbing our domain that we're going to put it underneath and in this case it's Rack Real Life, in your case it would be whatever and we're just going to click Add Host. At that point you've created a subdomain uh, it's right here and um, you're ready to go ahead and either create email addresses on it do installs on it, push your website up to it, whatever that may be and we'll do that in another video.